Guys, look around me. What you see here is millions of COVID-19 vaccines. Millions of frozen bottles of vaccines ready to be shipped around the world to a place near you. For the first time ever, I want to show you behind the scenes of Mission Impossible. The mission to bring a vaccine to everyone on planet Earth. What? Minus 90 Celsius? Can I see open up? Wow, this is cool. See, creating a vaccine is hard, but shipping a vaccine can be just as hard. How do you get a vaccine for 1 billion people in India and 200,000 people in Samoa? That's why I came here to Abu Dhabi, to the Hope Consortium. This is like the headquarters of vaccines. It is where most vaccines come in order to be shipped around the world. The people here are working 24-7 to deliver hope and this is how so they just got a new shipment of a hundred thousand new vaccines that will be distributed probably tomorrow or the day after they have to put everything in the freezer very very fast before it goes back see for a vaccine to stay effective it needs to be cold the entire time some need five degrees celsius while others need minus 80 degree Celsius to stay effective. So they built the world's largest freezer farm. Look at how big this is. The temperature right now is minus 20 Celsius. And it's really cold. Let's get out of here. Which means this place can store over 120 million vaccines from labs all over the world. These vaccines are frozen at an ultra cold temperature, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We've moved over 40 million vaccines here to date um, through the whole consortium to over 30 countries globally. That's a lot, isn't it? It is a lot, um, and it's, but it's not enough. These vaccines cannot be stored forever. They need to be shipped as fast as possible to people in need. So they used the world's largest transportation fleet. Thousands of trucks, vans, and planes. They put the vaccines in special moving freezers, load the freezer to the trucks, to the planes, to the trucks again, where they finally get to your country, to your clinic, and to you. This is my blood test, and my, my vaccine went up here somewhere. And you good? I'm good. Are you excited? I'm very excited. I'm excited to get home. <laughs> the HOPE Consortium also sends special vaccination trucks, doctors and nurses, for example, to countries in need in Africa, so you can get vaccinated inside the trucks. Of course, dealing with vaccines is very sensitive, so you can never lose a single bottle. So every single vaccine is tracked in real time using blockchain to make sure it stays within the cold temperature in the long journey, so no vaccine can be wasted. Our role as Maqta Gateway, as one of the founders of the Hub Consortium, is to be the digital partner. Our solution, Immunity, is the solution that is facilitating the track and trace of the vaccine from manufacturing all the way to the patient. This is not a one-person operation. This is thousands of people working day and night on the ground and in the air to save your life and mine. So this is a 24-7 operation. Our team are absolutely dedicated to the mission. The mission is move as many vaccines as we can in as short as possible time as possible. And it's working. So far, they shipped over 40 million doses to over 35 different countries in the Middle East, Africa, Asia, Europe, South America. So there is a high chance they shipped your vaccine as well. When was the last time you took a vacation? Since the pandemic, we don't take leave. It's only 24-7. From storage, to freezers, to transportation, to trucking, to people. These guys are making vaccines accessible, not just for the rich, but for every country in the world. Because when it comes to pandemics, no one is safe until everyone 
इससे